All right, in this video, we're just going to show you how to use the uh, TI-83 calculator to do a stats calculation using a frequency table. So the first thing we want to do is we want to close off or sorry, clear our lists in memory in the calculator. So <clears throat> click second function, and then the plus key. Um, hold on here, second function, <clears throat> mem for the plus key, and then we're going to choose item number four, which is clear all lists and that'll execute a command that'll clear the memory. Thing, next thing we'll do is go into our stats menu and we're going to choose number one to edit and we're going to use the cursor key to go to list one and we're going to set in our first set of data points here. So this is a midpoint of a uh, scores and frequency table. So the first number is 10, 30, 50, 70, and 90. Then we want to move over to list number two, so you can use the, the arrow pad again and move over to list two and we're going to put in a frequency of two for 10, 18 for 30, 62 for 50, and 15 for 70, and three for 90. And now we are able to use this data to calculate um, some of our statistical um, properties. So we'll hit stat again and we're going to use the arrow key to go over to the calc menu and we're going to choose item number one which is one variable statistics so we'll choose one but now what we have to do is we have to <clears throat> feed in the two lists that uh, are going to be acting on our functions so what we do is we hit second function one and that says we're going to use list one and type comma and then second function two and that will give us access to list two then we'll hit enter and then we see our stats that come up. So this tells us that the mean is 49.8, uh, the sum of all x terms is 4,980, then we have the squared, and then finally we have our standard deviation, um, sigma x there at the bottom, which is 14.55. Okay, and it also tells us we have 100 data points um, in our, in our um, in our calculation. So that's a quick way to use a frequency table to enter values into the calculator and generate the statistical properties that you may be asked for.